here are a few tips to pick the perfect watermelon. Check the stem. If it's green, that means the watermelon was picked before it had the chance to become ripe. If the stem is brown, that means the watermelon ripened on the vine. Look for an obvious yellow spot on the watermelon. If there is no yellow spot or a very faint white spot, that means the watermelon did not have enough time to bathe in the sun to become ripe. A big yellow spot indicates a well ripened watermelon. Press on the watermelon. If it has a little give to the watermelon, that means the watermelon is ripe. If the watermelon is too hard and has no give when you press against the skin of the watermelon, that means the watermelon is not ripe at all. Finally, tap the watermelon. If it sounds hollow, that means it's filled with water. A watermelon that does not sound hollow when tapped means it does not have much water content. So I'm picking this watermelon. You want to look for a big yellow spot and you want to listen to it when you knock on it. It should sound hollow. That means it's filled with water. Another thing you want to look for is right where it was attached to the wine that this is brown and not green. Green indicates that it was picked prematurely. Brown means it aged on the wine. So let's put it to the test. Let's cut it up. A watermelon that is ripe means it's filled with water and is super sweet. It looks really red and is filled with water. And I tasted a piece of this watermelon and it was sugary sweet.